How's it going, everyone? Equinox Phoenix here, and today we have Batwoman season three, episode seven, titled "Pick Your Poison." Where to begin? Where to begin? Um, Ryan betrays Marcus. That, that that's where we're gonna begin. Uh, turns him over to Jada. In exchange for Jada coming up with a cure for Mary. Speaking of Mary, Mary wakes up as Alice is driving in an RV. Apparently, uh, Mary broke uh, the Tesla from last episode. Or was it a Porsche? The electric vehicle that I don't... It's an electric vehicle. I'm pretty sure it's a Tesla. But anyway. Uh, I actually don't know or care what the car is. Like, realistically. Anyway. Um, Mary broke the car. Uh, getting out of Gotham. And... Uh, yeah. So she's an RV. Now, Mary's like, we gotta stop. We gotta stop. We gotta stop. Uh, Alice, of course, is just like... She stops the car. She's like, okay. Now, Alice and Mary converse. In it, Alice convinces Mary to flush out the uh, the toxins. Not the toxins, the nanobots in her blood. But unfortunately for Alice... Alice has O negative blood, the universal donor. Unfortunately for the universal donor, they can only receive blood from negative. And um, fun fact, I'm O positive, which means I can receive blood from O positive and O negative. But uh, yeah, not as bad as Al as Alice, but uh. Anyway, so they go to a bar, right? A pub, uh, if you will. Um, and uh, Mary finds out that her pheromone mind control powers are coming to fruition uh, when she accidentally mind controls the, <laughs> the lady at the bar. <laughs> and I was like, ooh, I think you've got mind control powers. Look, your eyes are now green. Uh, and... Uh, they then test it uh, to get free drinks. And uh... afterwards, um, they uh, decide to mind control someone into uh, giving uh, giving up some of their blood. And they go on the search for uh, O-negative blood, which they do successfully find. And um... uh, Alice manages to flush out the... Uh... Alice and Mary managed to flush out all of the blood they need um, from uh, with the nanobots, and uh, all's well that ends well, right? Wow, I was just like half a frame per second. Holy shit. Uh, my, my PC do be dying. Anyway. Um. As, uh, they're finished with the, uh, blood transfusion, a, uh, police officer shows up and is like, you're in a solar vehicle, please step out. Um. Alice is like, yeah, now we're gonna book it. And they, um, they run over the cop. Luckily, uh, or maybe not luckily. Uh, they miss the cop with the tires. He just goes underneath the, the, the RV. And Mary's like, oh shit, like, right, because obviously she's still, like, she's still in transition between old Mary and new Mary, where new Mary is, like, you know, actually stands up for herself. Um, but yeah, and, and she just, like, <laughs> she takes a deep breath as Al Alice is like, look, we gotta go, unless you want to be put in Arkham or something, we gotta go. <laughs> and so Mary takes a deep breath, sorry, old me, and they book it. Uh... As they're tossing off the remains of Alice's old blood, 
they get caught. Now, rewind. What? Back to uh Ryan and crew. Um, Ryan heads off uh, to the bat cave, where um she admits to Sophie and Luke that she's been working with Jada because Marcus is a psychopath. And they're looking for a cure. Now, uh, they're obviously they're chase they spent the episode uh chasing down Alice and uh they find out that Alice has um spread her blood because she like cut her finger or whatever, uh to like multiple cars. So that they can't track her. Uh it's it's hard to track. Um while this is going on, um Marcus escapes and kills off a couple people. But the cure is done. And um, Marcus has taken the cure after killing off the, uh, the lady responsible for making it. I don't. Uh, he like stabbed her with like scalpels. It, it's actually really gross to see. Um, like, yikes. Uh, maybe tone down the special effects makeup. <laughs> It was also really shocking because, like, they're all going into, like, a thing for the cure and a person pops out. Like, that's a bit... Yikes. Although, to be fair, this is Gotham City. Um, you know, it's probably part for the course of Gotham City. Uh, Marcus goes and more or less blackmails Ryan into giving up Wayne. In exchange for the cure. Ryan gets the cure. Now, they finally successfully track down Mary and Alice. Because uh, all of the other um, signals are taken down because the blood is dried off. And... <sighs> Batwoman catches up to them right after they uh, escape from running over the cop. And... <laughs> Alice comes out with... What I think is a crowbar? It's just a long piece of what looks like metal. Uh, you couldn't really see it because it was nighttime. And... Obviously Mary comes out. Now, Mary has gone full Poison Ivy. Or she's gone full po uh, Poison Mary, as uh, Alice dubbed her. Uh, so when Ryan's like, oh, uh, we got the cure, like, come back. Uh, Mary's like, what are you going to do if I refuse to take the cure? And she uses the mind control pheromones, and Ryan admits that, um, yeah, we're gonna lock you up. <laughs> and Mary's like, yeah, no, fuck you. <laughs> You're not listening to me. Um, just goes full poison ivy, gra grabs onto uh, Batwoman with the, the uh, vines. Alice uh, removes the grapple from the Batmobile on the RV, and they go off into the uh, sunrise, as it were, because it's almost sunrise. Um, the next scene is Alice asleep and Mary driving as the sun pierces the horizon! And she goes full-fledged Poison Mary. Um, uh, now, the only scenes remaining are Marcus take it, performing a hostile takeover on Wade Enterprises and uh, waking his mother up by calling her, calling his mother or whatever. I don't know. Like I really don't. It, it, he's like, just watch watch the new watch any channel at nine a.m. tomorrow. Um. Uh. And that's where he announces he's taking over Wayne and whatnot. And Mary comes out, and she is full of cut now. There's also Alice and Mary in a po in a motel a room. Alice is hungover as fuck. And she's like, I need hash browns and shit, stat. <laughs> uh, and Mary's like, what's taking you? And she's asking Mary, what's taking her so long? She's like, look. I know I make it easy, but it takes a long time to make bad 
look this good. And she comes out, her hair is like red. She's in like full poison ivy getup, which we were given a preview of earlier this week. And oh my lord. Nicole Kang looks fucking amazing. Just the new poison ivy. Anyway, um, they decide we're gonna have fun, right? Like, I, 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 okay, I enjoy this episode just seeing the like the bond grow between, uh, between uh, like the sisterly bond grow between the two girls, uh, and also just Mary just saying fuck you to the to, to the team, just like fuck you guys. Now I did. Kind of, sort of, skip over... I mean, no, I fully skipped over uh, Marcus beating up Luke because it's not relevant. He beat up Luke. And that was like... Luke, 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 Luke's arm was in a sling, man. That, that That's not a fight. Anyway. That was the episode, and honestly, uh, we'll be back January 12th, apparently, so that means the upload will be January 13th. Um... Because I obviously I have to wait the next day. Because when they come out for me, it's like really late at night, and I'm already in bed. But yeah, uh, that's the episode. Tell me what you guys thought of it down in the comment section down below. That's gonna be it for this video. If you guys haven't already hit like, hit subscribe if you're new. I'll see you guys next time. And as always, stay bright. Oh, I forgot to mention. Uh, as much as I want Alice to have a redemption arc, uh, I will take a uh, redemption arc in the eyes of Mary. It works. Bye-bye.